Yes, it does. It makes me like not want to really put myself online or put myself out there anymore. It makes me want to just hibernate. <laughs> Think about the cloud. It's kind of I understand, but don't really understand where all that information goes. It seems like all the hackers and stuff, if they really want it, they can get a lot of your information, which is a little unsettling. I don't think it's hard. I just think we, we in this world, doesn't, we don't have time. It, I mean, I definitely think about it, but I'm not, I mean, it's hard to like sit there and just be concerned about it constantly. I mean, being immersed in the space that we're in and working within it, each and every day and, and seeing it in the news and then seeing what we're dealing with and what we're trying to protect on the behalf of consumers and businesses alike, um, you know, it definitely gives me a heightened sense of awareness and alertness to what is actually possible. I use different passwords for all my accounts, but they kind of have the same base with just a different number at the end for each one. I'm pretty sure that should be enough to fool hackers, but I'm not sure. Just for my memory, I try to keep it similar with small changes because I wouldn't be able to remember if not. Yeah, I change my passwords regularly, I mean at least once a month. Oh yeah, yeah, because it's not, I, I've had my uh, identity stolen from me before, several years ago, yeah. Yeah, actually a couple of months ago, um, I found out that even though I'm here, someone was using my credit card in Florida. My parents uh, had their identity hacked through, I believe it was TurboTax. I noticed through my debit card actually that it was being used for Lyft before I even knew what Lyft was a couple years back. Yeah, I mean, I definitely check my credit card statements and make sure it's all mine, stuff like that. I feel like I definitely could be doing more. I use incognito mode when I browse. Try to always click the cookies button, disable. It's, it's something that we should all take very, very seriously. Yeah, 100%. I'd say prior to working at Kaspersky Lab, I was a little bit more careless, I'd say, or carefree in terms of what I was worried about. I think being at Kaspersky has now given me a heightened sense of awareness and vigilance around what I look to protect and how I go about protecting it, uh, more so than what I had done previously, 100%.